Good day, everyone, and welcome back to our weekly webinar. As you guys know that we are back in our office, so no longer running our webinar from home, but we still maintain the social distancing here, so we are safe. Yeah, thank you very much, guys, for joining us today. The session of today is going to be very interesting, and we can guarantee that you guys are going to enjoy this session. So today is the virtual launch of Shure Audio Ecosystem for Conferencing Solution, where we will introduce you some of the newest and exciting products and that we are bringing to the market. The audio chain is complete now, and you will come to know soon. So let's go through with that. A little bit intro about the team who is going to run this session. Uh, I am Ruthain. I'm uh, the part of application team in Middle East and Africa. Anish is, uh, is uh, the host as well, and he is taking care of application in Middle East Africa. Along with us, we have Mosman. I believe most of you guys know him. He is a part of product marketing and joining us to support this session. As we get started, let's take a moment to go through the timeline of recent innovation from Shure. I'm pretty much sure you know about this product. Tour has been in business since last 95 years, and we are well known for our innovations. We always love to have something new in the market. Uh, back in 2016, we introduced the Microflex Advanced Ceiling Array Microphone, which was a new class in conferencing microphone, unequaled in design, performance, and support. This microphone basically surpassed our customer expectation. Frankly, you can say that the microphone has grown up now, after that, these advancements in microphone technology basically revealed how off-the-shelf DSP, the black box, were not working as far with because of the technology was kind of outdated. So Shure once again innovated an advancement in DSP technology with the introduction of the Intel MX P300 conferencing microphone uh, processor a hardware processor that is readily handles these next generation microphone while providing as of deployment and simple connectivity for conferencing spaces across the world. The Intel MX P300, I believe you guys are already using it for your installation, also brought through network audio encryption between the microphone and DSP. For those users who are basically concerned about the security and privacy of their conferences, this product works pretty well, fits pretty well with the help of uh, audio encryption, what we offer um, with our Intel MX P300. You can encrypt the audio from the microphone to the DSP, so nobody else can just simply jump in your conference call and get the audio out through the network. Yeah, sure. Of course, you guys are knowing, and we are pretty much knowing that we always love to push the boundaries in everything we do. So we thought out of the box and we introduced something uh, in the market in this ISE that's called Intelimix Room. Yeah. As you move from presenter to presenter or conference spaces to conference spaces, you will experience some familiar hardware, but you will also notice something is missing. In fact, you might notice several hardware system component is missing. A new era in conferencing room audio is born by using component already installed in the conferencing spaces, utilizing the computing power built in into the existing uh, in-room PC, running the soft codec, Tour's new Intel MX Room application handles all the conferencing audio processing that is needed. No more need of for a bulky rack mounted external DSP. The software can be installed in the software codec. Uh, the PC which is running the software codec like Zoom, Sky for Business, Teams, Cisco WebEx, and you can utilize the processing power of the of the PC itself by having our IntelliMix Room software DSP. Yeah. So, and the, if you if you ask about the specification, is more or less almost similar like the soft codec uh, requirement for the PCs, like i5 processor, 8 GB RAM, 4 core and solid state drives. So if you have that PC installed with your software-based conferencing codec, you can install our Intel Mix Room and it can do the job of the conferencing DSP. So no more black box in the room. It's all through the given technology what is required for running a 
standard conferencing call through soft codex. Now, the next product what we are going to show you it was long awaited product which was requested by everyone. So let's have a look on this. We have capitalized on the success what we had with our array microphone. We are introducing a new form factor in the MXA line. As you can see over here, we got a MXA addition, a, a new member in MXA family. Many times, as you know, that a table array or a square ceiling array just don't fit in the architecture or design criteria. So today, as you work through our conferencing spaces, you will experience a new array microphone form factor, the MXA 710, two feet and four feet linear array microphone. This microphone can be installed horizontally. As you can see over here in this picture, the microphone is below the camera, installed horizontally, and uh, yeah, it's just it. The microphone is going to offer you single cat 5e cable connection and you just connect with the network switch. Yeah, I'm having a microphone over here, which I can show you quickly. This is the two feet one uh, white color. The microphone is pretty much straightforward. You just have the option to install on the wall. You see there is a RJ45 connection here and you can just release the cable and then take it out from here. And if you want pull it back on the wall, you can do as well. So the cable is going to be hidden. It is not going to come out from the microphone. So no overlap on the wall. Yeah. And other things will be discussed soon. So let's wait for that. Another shot, what you see here is two foot microphone installed vertically over here. Yeah. And now, if you understood what we have now, I'm going to introduce another innovation from show. So we know that the conference room of the future demands an end-to-end -end solution. We are pretty much aware about that. So today you will see and hear another innovation solution that completes the audio chain, single chain, a new Dante-enabled PoE network ceiling speaker. This is the Microflex MXN5WC. This is our network-based ceiling, ceiling speaker. Yeah. So consider it's offering Dante, so that old bulky amplifier for the speaker is gone too, which shows new ceiling, network ceiling loudspeaker. Imagine that, only one PoE switch connects all the endpoint devices, and it's all software in the middle, like Intellimix room, conferencing codec like Zoom, Skype for Business and all. Just imagine the possibilities. We are definitely excited about it. So over the course, course of this launch, you will experience several different but typical soft codec conferencing spaces. We will be discussing breakout room conferencing spaces to see up close the benefit that all these new technology brings and how Intellimix Room makes it all possible. So let's discuss about a new, C, a new linear arrays microphone MXA710. So let's take an example over here, a small and medium conference room space. So see here, uh, you see there is a Logitech tab connected with Zoom call, right? It's linked with Zoom rooms. It's connected with USB with the, with the PC, room PC, which is gonna run Zoom call. The same PC is gonna have IMX room installed because it's a software-based conferencing DSP. The PC is having USB connection over here to have the conference call to, to capture the participant. Now, over here, you see MXA 7102 feet, which is perfect enough to cover the size of the room. We will talk about the coverage later. It's connected via network cable. And here you see MX and WC, that's our network ceiling speaker. Yeah, that's connected over here through the network switch. So as you can see, there is no bulky rack here. There is no rack. Everything is connected through the network cable with the network switch. And it's just the PC you can mount behind the display under the table. So nothing is visible except the microphone and the Logitech tap to run the Zoom call. And if you have noticed here, we also have something called MXA NMB. This is our new innovation, network mute button. So 
we are definitely going to talk about this, but this is also connected with the network cable with the PoE switch. And you have the control to control the microphone and the IMX room DSP. Yeah. So imagine no rack, nothing, everything is connected to the network. And imagine the possibility how exactly it is simplifying this kind of installation for your rooms. Yeah. So talking about next generation MX array, we have been always asked that the moment we launched our ceiling array and table array microphone, uh, we have been asked by several customers that these products are great, but we need something in the middle of it uh, to offer for the cost effective room for the solution. So uh, few customers came to us saying, can we install this MXA 310 on wall? Can we install uh, on the ceiling? Yeah, then we were always listening to that. So we that was the reason for thinking about this innovation of MXA 710. And now we have a solution which fits in between of these two product portfolio, what you are already aware about it. It works pretty well for the cost effective solution, cost effective rooms, because of course it's gonna be uh, Price competitive compared to our ceiling array microphone um, because it's having a smaller form factor and it's designed for a small and medium size of the conference rooms and meeting rooms. So talking about the features uh, of MXA 710, the 710 linear array microphone can be secured on wall, ceiling on table. So there is no limitation like MXA 910, the ceiling array microphone should always install on ceiling. Now 710, if you want to install on the wall, on the ceiling, on the table, it's all gonna fit with this seven array linear array microphone. It's available in two feet. The one what I was showing you here, this is two feet. And if you just zoom a little bit on the camera feed, uh, you can see four feet is installed next to me and the camera is shooting that view. So that's the four feet one. And it offers three different color, black, white, and aluminum. Uh, we cannot paint it like 910. It's having the fixed color, black, aluminum, and white color. Yeah. So MXA talking about a few more features of 710. It offers stereo coverage technology like other MXA microphone. Two foot uh, linear array 710 offers you four lobes. Eight, uh, sorry, four foot array microphone offers you eight lobes. And like MXA 910, it offers autofox focus technology. And I'm pretty much sure you know what is autofocus. The microphone is always gonna sense the voice of the talker and it will adjust itself. So if the meeting is casual, you are moving forward, leaning back on your chair, moving your head, still it is gonna pick you with the best intelligibility because the autofocus is always gonna steer to the voice and give you the maximum intelligibility. Uh, the microphone comes with the default room coverage templates. So it is like an out of box solution. So we know how, what kind of low configuration required for the table, for the ceiling, for the wall. So you can straight away use default room coverage templates. But if you want to adjust to get better result, the, the microphone offers you the possibility to configure as well. You can adjust the loops. Yeah, like other MXA, MXA 710 includes includes Intellimix DSP that provides all the processing needed for echoes and noise-free audio. Yeah, it offers you automatic mixing like 910 AEC built in with 710 as well. It offers you noise reduction and automatic gain control to improve the intelligibility uh, from the microphone itself. Yeah. Now talking about a few more features, it is PoE powered. It offers Dante and AS67 network audio, LED status bar, bars with configurable colors and brightness, true audio encryption compatible, so you can have the audio encrypted, and you can configure using the designer's configuration software uh, to this microphone. And you can also have the asset management uh, software integrated with our linear array microphone, that's true system on, to have the management and troubleshooting. So if anything goes wrong, you can receive SMS and email notification because Zoo System On is taking care of the asset management. Now, 
and if you know end user wants a consistent experience across the room and across location throughout the world tour makes this this easy by providing a complete set of audio products that covers all room sizes you just pick the microphone form factor that works for your space and then design and commission your room with our designer software and the 710 has the most versatile mic form factor yet you know we have been asked by a couple of key customer who were having concerns because of the current situation users don't want to touch the microphone they want it hidden yeah they want something which look aesthetically good yeah and all these without compromising in the audio quality and intelligibility and trust me 70 fits well in all these requirement because the microphone is going to be on wall on table on ceiling so you are away from the microphone you don't need to have the physical interaction with the microphone and it offers the best intelligibility what you need for your conferencing spaces yeah now let's talk about the accessories what is included in the box so we offer you the wall mounted bracket with the box itself we also offer wall cover plate yeah to install for for the surface mounting and we also offer eyelet screw for suspension mounting so if you want to have the suspension mount you can use the eyelet screws we also have optional accessories actually we have a lot of accessories which you will see today optional accessories to have the desk stand so you can just simply mount the uh, stand accessory and you can keep in front of your table uh, we will show you that you can also have the optional accessories for the tile bridge for installing the microphone on the ceiling yeah so if you want to install we can offer the accessories for that we also have flush mount kit for walls for tables or hard ceiling so you just need to install this accessories and microphone will be in the middle of that yeah we also have mic stand adapter so the four screw holes are compatible with weza mounting products made by third party devices so you can attach the 710 to a video display mount yeah so as you see there are many options to install so it's not limiting you the way you want you can just use this microphone with the best intelligibility in industry a uh, couple of examples here the microphone four fit uh, linear array microphone installed behind the dis below the display you can also install above the display you can install on the side and we can also offer a dummy unit to match the aesthetics of the room without the electronics so on your right hand side suppose this is the microphone you can have the dummy uh, microphone uh, basically to match the aesthetics of the room without the electronics the room can easily cover with one microphone but few interior designers are having the concern on the aesthetic side so having the dummy microphone on other side will help yeah few examples uh, of the insulation you can hung from the ceiling flush mount into wall or ceiling this is how it looks you must have noticed that the green color over here yeah that's basically the led colors which is customizable you can configure in any colors like 910 and 310 uh, when the led is off it's behind the grill so it is not visible so when the microphone is off nothing is going to be visible if you change if you set the color like red for mute green for unmute so that time it lets yeah so smart design nothing written on top no name led bar is also behind the grill so very neat and clean installation that's what you can have not only that we can also offer uh, we can you can also install the microphone table with the acoustically transparent acoustic fabric uh, there are certain um, specification of acoustic fabric so if you guys want to have uh, those kind of installation feel free to contact us we can give you the specification of acoustic fabric um right now what you see is the two fit uh, linear array mxa710 install on the table now let's talk about the lobe characteristic uh, like i'm pretty much sure that you know about mxa910 the 910 is having a kind of beam and which just steer in all three dimension right and uh, because of that you can just steer all across the room anywhere the 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 loop what you get with mxa710 is basically uh, one dimensional yeah and you can steer in one direction it is like a kind of uh, this way 
and you can steer it in any direction and uh, uh, basically up and down. Yeah. So what we say it is a kind of slice toroidal uh, toroidal pattern uh, picking up uh, from around the microphone. Yeah. You can basically the, the the to imagine how exactly the microphone is picking up is like a if it is installed on the wall horizontally, it's 90 degree from the microphone. That's the picking up uh, pattern from the 710. Uh, as said, this is the example if the microphone is installed on the wall horizontal. So default templates are available. So that works pretty well with the with the standard configuration. So you can just utilize that. Uh, talking about the coverage of uh, this linear array microphone, two foot basically uh, picks up up to 16 feet, which is more or less like 4.8 meter away and four foot picks up up to 20 feet, which is six meter. Yeah, and uh, like 910, it's also having lobe and lobes are adjustable in narrow, medium and wide. So narrow is 30 degree, medium is 40 degree and wide is 70 degree. Yeah, so just to correlate how, how, the way you are already aware about 910. Uh, if you install the microphone vertically on the wall, like this one, like for example, you install like this. So you see when you install this one, so the lobe is gonna have the pickup like this. So it is more or less like uh, uh, covering uh, the entire room with one lobe. Uh, you can have more than one. If it is two feet, you can have up to four lobe, but when you install vertically, it is basically taking care by one lobe without having any intelligible issue. This is a side view, what you see here, and it is to help you to understand from where the microphone is picking up, and you can steer the lobe up and down. Yeah, so that to simplify the installation and uh, to understand how exactly the lobe uh, behaves when you install vertically. And uh, this is the example, the screenshot of designer screenshot of uh, uh, microphone installed on ceiling. Yeah. So I'll just give you kind of uh, the the character, the specification, a little bit of a specification side. Two feet is having less number of element. If you know about 910, you know the microphone is having more than 100 elements to uh, have the to offer the loops, right? So same way, the linear array microphone two feet is having up to 50 elements. Uh, which is just offering you the coverage up to 16 feet. When we talk about four feet, that's bigger. It's having more element, 100 elements approx. So it gives you wider coverage because more elements, more control on the on the on the lobes. Yeah. Now um, I be, I, I'm pretty much sure you enjoyed that. Means the new innovation what we have done is going to help you guys in your uh, coming installation. Uh, now let's talk about other products a uh, little bit about that uh, Intellimix room and network mute button. So we introduced Intellimix room this uh, year in ISC and it's available. It's ready for sale. So you need to talk with uh, uh, your uh, uh, authorized partner who can offer you the license. You can also have the demo license if you want to try for 90 days. Now talking about Intellimix room. Uh, we are pretty much familiar with all these uh, conferencing platform like Zoom, BlueJeans, Microsoft Teams, Cisco WebEx. Yeah, and these are basically uh, these are usually uh, run. These usually run on uh, the, the the standard PCs, uh, and you can install this in Telemix room in the same PC itself. It offers the integration seamlessly with the soft codec. It arguments limited audio input and uh, input found on the soft codecs and seamless to end users workflow. So nowadays, this is a trend. Most of the calls are happening through the soft codec, but that's not it. When you go back to office, you also need to look on the solution which can be integrated with the same uh, with the same way like you did with the soft codec. So I'm pretty much sure you guys are familiar about with the Think Smart Hub, Crystal Flex, Logitech Tab. And PC running the soft codec. So Intellimix room can complement these hardwares as well because it can be installed because these are Windows machine basically. Yeah, they run on Windows platform. So you can install Intellimix room in that and you can complement the technology and the room uh, capability by having Intellimix room installed on that. Yeah, you can scale uh, acoustic eco cancellation uh, based on the room capacity. As you know, 
which we have covered in our previous webinar, Intellimix Room is having eight and 16 channels of uh, uh, Dante input with all the audio processing like AEC, noise reduction, uh, AGC, uh, equalization and all. And Intellimix Room can offer individual AEC for each channel. You can have different AEC reference for different channels. That's the possibility and the power of Intellimix uh, Room DSP. So it complements the echo, acoustic echo cancellation technology. You can install on Microsoft OS platform. Very competitive price to expand a small room opportunity. If you ask me, it's almost one third of the price of a standard black box DSP, what you usually uh, have in the standard conference room. And it is exclusively sold through the Shure authorized distributor. Yeah. So that's all from my side. I believe, I, I trust you guys enjoyed the new product. Now I'm going to hand over the floor to my colleague Anish. He's going to take you through a few more products, exciting products. So enjoy that and I'll be back with, with the hardware demo. Thank you guys. Thank you, Ritin. Once again, I welcome everybody uh, to today's virtual launch preview of the Shure audio ecosystem for conferencing. We are very excited to present our latest innovations and reiterate that the audio chain is now complete. So we'll be discussing about the MXA network mute button. The MXA mute button is the newest member of the MXA family. You might have the, uh, have the question in mind that uh, why have we created a network mute button? Because uh, this is a heavily requested product uh, from a lot of our end users and our dealers. And, uh, you know, as you know that we, we have streamlined some of the soft codec and hard codec within an AV conferencing room. And we keep most of the equipments behind the display. And uh, since we also have our MXA 910 installed on the ceiling or the new MXA 710 installed on the wall, we need a simplistic, easy to program button to be installed within the room and uh, you know configurable with uh, with the designer software and also to give a visual cue on the table also uh, we need to have a physical way to mute and unmute the mic or like change the led on the mxa 910 installed on the ceiling or the mxa 710 installed on the wall and all of this without adding uh, extra parts or pieces to the setup or without breaking the bank So the, the key features of the MXA uh, network mute button uh, are going to be discussed in this particular slide. So you can use the designer sister configuration tool for easier setup and configuration of the MXA uh, network mute button. So you can also work with the Sure system on audio asset management software for remote management and troubleshooting. Uh, without, you know, uh, to, you know, without physically checking the system or visiting the room. The unit is PoE powered and uh, it is compatible with a third party control system and also we offer programmable control strings. So the control strings are available uh, and you can leverage the NMB or the network mute button outside of a Sure ecosystem. And it can also perform much more functions like uh, mute, uh, you know, much more functions than mute when you combine with a control system. Like you can uh, turn a cross point on or off or trigger certain events like a camera preset or something like that. Uh, you know, you need to combine it with a control system, that's all. So uh, uh, the LED status on the uh, network mute button is also configurable and the colors and brightness should, uh, you know, it can be configured remotely using the designer software. So it also supports different modes like, uh, you know, push to talk, push to mute or toggle, which is very convenient as per the desired meeting flow. And the unit is IP1X rated and it supports easy table installation in one inch, which is 25 mm or seven by eight uh, inch or uh, like uh, 22 mm uh, kind of hole. So to recap, the MXA NMB is a configurable PoE powered mute button accessory and it is designed uh, for the muting and unmuting of a sure network pro product like Microflex Advanced Array Microphones, or Intellimix P300, uh, the Intellimix room, and any USB matrix. So one or multiple low-profile touch-sensitive mute buttons can be configured. 
uh, to mute either one or multiple MXA microphones depending on the user needs or room configurations. So this is like a, pr a typical example. Uh, the, the microphone MXA 710 and a MXA 310 are connected to a P300, uh, which is a Teams, uh, a Microsoft Teams and Zoom certified product from Shaw. So the network mute button is also connected via PoE and it could be utilized to mute the auto mixer within the P300 and change the LED status of the MXA 710 and the MXA 310. So uh, we are uh, we are excited to discuss about the new uh, Shure network ceiling mic uh, ceiling speakers, which is the MXN5 WC. The the key features. Uh, let's discuss about the key features. Uh, you can use the Shure system designer uh, configuration software for the easiest and most uh, you know, uh, you know uh, uh, easiest setup and configuration of the speaker. And uh, you can use the system on audio asset management software for the remote management and troubleshooting of the unit. The speaker is compatible with Shure audio encryption. So AES-256 from microphone to DSP and from DSP to loudspeaker is supported, so which is across the entire audio chain. Again, not many manufacturers have this kind of functionality, so it is very unique. And next is the design elements. Uh, let's talk a little bit more about the design elements. The speaker has a very clean design and it blends into drop ceiling environment very subtly. And uh, it works very well in your installations. And it has a removable magnetic and paintable grill, which seamlessly covers the entire speaker. So the Shure logo uh, is also magnetic and can be uh, removed very easily. And also uh, it can be refitted very easily. The speaker is UL2043 uh, plenum rated. So this rating is used for bringing like uh, safe connectivity to plenum spaces and to protect property and lives from damages caused uh, by fire, you know, as well as smoke uh, that is resulting from fire. So there is a tile bridge accessory also available for quick and easy mounting. The other features of the speaker are like, uh, you know, the speaker is PoE and PoE plus enabled, eliminating the need for an external amplifier. The, the unit has magnetic uh, grills which could be removed and fixed at ease. So it offers a bezel-less design for the speaker. Uh, uh, you can notice it here. It has a 5.25 inch uh, or five and a quarter inch uh, driver, uh, which is like a two-way or a coaxial driver. And it gives you maximum results out of the system within such a compact design. So the, the back can uh, is, is of a shallow depth type and uh, the dimensions are like 12 inch by four inch deep, which is roughly like 30 centimeters by 10 centimeters. And the tile bridge and pre-construction uh, brackets are available, uh, ready with us. And there is a screw on, uh, on the top uh, of the speaker face to adjust the dog leg clamps on the sides. Uh, the unit is priced and packaged as single units or uh, each unit. And, uh, you know, let's discuss about the output voltage as well. Uh, so as I mentioned, uh, the, uh, the speaker unit supports PoE and PoE plus. So PoE will give you a 12 watt draw out of the switch uh, towards the speaker. And uh, the SPL rating would be around 92, D 92 dB SPL at one meter. And if you utilize PoE plus, it will give you a 24 watt draw out of the switch to the speaker and uh, the SPL will be 98 dB SPL at one meter. And uh, we would definitely uh, recommend uh, to use PoE plus for more wattage raw and SPL levels for larger rooms, of course. And uh, uh, if you talk about the frequency range, uh, the frequency range is 120 hertz to 20 kilohertz, and the speaker is tailor-made for speech applications. So this is not recommended for a BGM kind of application or to be used uh, like a constant voltage system like 100 volt or 70 volt at the moment. So let's take an example of a huddle room uh, where we can utilize the MXN uh, you know, 5WC network ceiling loudspeaker installed via PoE. So we are utilizing our latest audio conferencing DSP software uh, that is the IMX room, which is installed in the same computer of that of the soft codec. Uh, like the video conferencing codec, uh, which is Zoom. Uh, you know, we can take as an uh, example of Zoom in this case. And IMX Room is available in either 8 or 16 channels, and it also works on the Microsoft uh, OS platform. 
uh, and it leverages the equipment which is already installed in the room itself. So you don't need to invest in a, a, in a costly DSP hardware. So the result is actually a high quality audio experience which is made available to the huddle space. And the setup could be easily deployed uh, via uh, the designer software, uh, which is like uh, version 4.2 would, would be uh, made available soon. Uh, the next example is that of a large conferencing space. Uh, in this room, we have the MXA 910, uh, which is still our best in class microphone system that you can definitely offer. Uh, and in addition to the MXA 910, we have a, spare, uh, we have a pair of MXN 5WC, which is the networked uh, uh, speakers and the MXA and MB uh, network mute button. So uh, we also have a kiosk PC on the table, which is installed with uh, the Zoom uh, soft codec and also have our IMX room uh, installed. You may notice that the uh, only the camera uh, is connected via USB and the PC feed to the display is via HDMI. The rest all uh, cables are, are category cables or like CAT6 cables, which makes the installation very IT friendly. For even larger conferencing spaces, uh, like uh, we can just keep on adding like uh, a pair of MXN 5WC network speakers and additional MXN 910 to factor in for the additional uh, area of coverage. So uh, technically with similar infrastructure, we can cover even larger spaces and we just need to utilize extra switch ports in order to power the additional devices. Yet uh, it could be scaled again to, uh, to, to cover even larger or like massive uh, spaces. And uh, we can add MXA 910 or MXA 5WC speaker pairs uh, based on the room length. And uh, ideally uh, with the same infrastructure, a little bit more cable and a larger PoE switch, uh, uh, you know, with additional PoE ports, we can accommodate the additional devices and uh, we can achieve the exceptionally high uh, quality AV conferencing experience within the room. Again, uh, to solidify your understanding on what we discussed so far, uh, we also wanted to confirm that we have recently been certified for Microsoft Teams. So Microsoft Teams, as you, as you uh, may know it as just simply Teams, is a unified communication and collaboration platform that combines like workplace chat or video meetings or file storage and application integration. So the, the service integrates with the Office 365 subscription, which is a Office productivity suite. And uh, you know it features extension that can integrate with non-Microsoft uh, products as well. So in our case, uh, the Sure P300 is the key element that enables the certification or integration with Teams. So if you take the following example in which the, uh, the MXA 310 and the MXN uh, 5WC is connected uh, via PoE to a switch, uh, the P300 is connected via PoE to the switch as well. And the USB of the P300 is connected to, to, to Microsoft Teams or, uh, or uh, you know, you can even utilize Zoom here. And uh, so once you connect that, uh, that P300 over USB, it will enable the mute sync functionality, which is available. And, uh, you know, thus you can uh, uh, ensure that it is Microsoft certified. And of course, the solution is, is scalable to much larger rooms. So the the, the uh, slide here depicts that uh, the the system adapts to larger rooms with similar infrastructure, and even larger rooms by just adding additional cables and accommodating them on a PoE network switch. So I hope that uh, by now you have got a feeling that Sure is uh, heading towards an ecosystem route. So we have a vision for a holistic, uh, you know, we have a vision for delivering a holistic end-to-end -end audio solution from a brand that you can trust. And Sure as a unique and uh, leading marketing uh, market experience in acoustics, wireless, DSP and software. We have uh, Microflex, uh, uh, you know, network transducer endpoints like uh, MXA microphones and the speakers with leading uh, uh, and classy uh, performance and, uh, you know, ease of use features. The Intellimix audio processing uh, with a distributed architecture is also available as a pure software and as a dedicated hardware uh, as well. And also uh, it, is, it is embedded on our, uh, you know, leading microphone uh, portfolio as well. So uh, the Shured network system software is also used for a simple device administration and a simple uh, 
you know, uh, 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 user can uh, administrate it, and also you can use it for mass deployments and third-party, you know, interfacing and integrations. So all of this are designed to work together. And as sure as uh, uh, it is all de designed to work together, and uh, sure ecosystem benefits are, are as followed. It offers unmatched and ease of uh, deployment, uh, so it is very uh, user friendly. So no other hardware or software platform, uh, you know, offers quicker out of box configuration similar to Sure, and the solution plays well with uh, with other uh, manufacturers. The compatibility, the certifications, and uh, you know, uh, is already implemented, and it is continuously being uh, you know improved. So Sure offers greater, uh, uh, you know, product support and monitoring. You have a single point of contact for technical support for the entire signal chain, which is a plus for the IT and the AV team managing the the system. You can also have uh, utmost confidence, in, you know, while you're communicating because from microphone to loudspeaker and uh, uh, your your meeting content is secured, and it supports Sure audio uh, encryption. So the solution is also Dante uh, Domain Manager ready. Uh, it enables audio networking to be more secure and scalable across an entire campus or enterprise uh, deployment. So next is uh, next. Uh, what we can offer is the pre-packaged hardware and the software bundle, which are readily available. So everything is designed to work together very seamlessly, with the added benefit of a single vendor uh, or a single point of sale approach. So this would make your deployments very faster. So let's take uh, some of uh, the examples of a room bundle. So for a small room, uh, we can have an MXA 310, uh, an Intellimix room installed on the same PC with the soft codec, and uh, have Sure, micro, uh, sure MX and 5WC speakers, and all of this brought to life with the Sure uh, designer software. How about a medium-sized room? So for a medium sized room, all you need is an MXA 910, an Intellimix room, the Sure MXN 5WC speakers, and again, all brought, of the, uh, brought to life by the, uh, the Sure designer software. Let's take an example for a medium room uh, with MXA 710, four feet, either installed on the wall or on the table with the addition of a network mute button, and the any USB is being used here. So as you may know that the any USB doesn't have a built-in Intellimix, it leverages the MXA 710's built-in DSP, which is an excellent fit for such application, and you don't have to resort to costly DSP hardware. And uh, you know, with with adding a couple of speakers and uh, utilizing Sure Designer software, you're good to go for a medium size. The next uh, bundling example is for a large room, so we can uh, consider a MXA 910 with a couple of mute buttons. Uh, the speakers as per room size. Uh, the room may have a requirement of being Zoom or Team certified, so uh, we can definitely use the Sure P300 hardware DSP for that particular certification. And uh, using P300 will help us achieve mute sync functionality. Again, the Sure Designer software brings the whole setup uh, together. Also, for a multi-purpose uh, room kind of bundling, uh, we can use several MXC 910. Uh, it can be packaged together uh, and uh, with along with several uh, Sure speakers, and you can utilize uh, the Intellimix room, probably the 16-channel one, and all of them uh, could be brought together, uh, you know, with the Sure designer software. So, in terms of availability, the MXA 710, uh, two feet and four feet, uh, the network speaker MXN 5WC, and the networked mute button uh, MXA and MB will be made available later this year. And the 8 and 16 channel IMX room for three and five year terms are already available. So please feel free to contact us for the demo or trial licenses if you have a requirement. And uh, the system on audio asset management software is available right now. For pricing information, please contact your Sure regional sales manager. Couple of other points to discuss before moving on to the demo session. So uh, we are participating in Infocom Connected, uh, which is the virtual audiovisual and integrated experience event for this year. So we have already a landing page, which is set up uh, for the same, and most of the stuff what we have discussed here will be populated there. And uh, we would uh, encourage you to visit and register for the same. 
So we would also request you to register on HTTP uh, showmiasa-sure.talentlms.com. So uh, this is for our SIIE portal or the Shore Audio Institute. It is an education and networking platform for Shure customers, you know, including system integrators, consultants, music industry retailers, engineers, and musicians. So if you are looking for advancing your career, improving your knowledge, or keeping your team or staff up to date, please get certified by Shure Audio Institute. Shure offers a variety of uh, online training for sales and technical enablement and uh, also general audio. So you can select the preferred uh, course available in your preferred language. The certifications are also self-paced. Also, in case of any supports or queries, uh, please feel free to reach uh, support underscore Miasa at uh, Shure.com. And uh, I'm having, handing over the floor to Ritan for the uh, software de uh, demo. Thank you for your patience. And if you have any further questions, please feel free to raise them at the Q&A window. Thank you. Thanks, Anish. Yes, it was fun. We learned a lot today, right, with all our new products and offering. OK, now let's quickly have a look on the demo side. Um, so as said, we are having all our new products uh, and it's with us over here. We are having a PC connected right now with uh, uh, with our uh, uh, network and connected with uh, our four feet uh, linear array microphone MXA710. This is the Sure Web Device Discovery software. And over here you can see uh, there are two ceiling speaker which you can see on camera as well. There is one full fit uh, linear array microphone and a Maxi mute mutton. Yeah, so all are connected. It's on the network. So I'm just going to take you through how exactly and how simple it is to configure. For that, first of all, you need a designer software. So I'm having my PC installed with designer software. I'm just going to open it and I have already prepared a setup. So once I explain that, I'm going to quickly demonstrate the audio quality of 710. I'm almost uh, four to five feet away from the microphone and let's see how exactly it performs in that distance. Yeah, so for that, uh, those who have already attended our webinar before, we had a software solution webinar and over there we had explained our designer software. So simple, we got an updated version. So this is the latest one. So I have created a project and test room. So when you open that, you get all the options of online devices which are available. And I have technically dragged all these over here. So those who know about designer is pretty much simple. You see the online devices on this side and you drag and drop on your work page, on your uh, project page. Online devices are visible over here. And the benefit of having designer and our ecosystem is like, you don't need to configure anything. It's just like you drag it. You add the microphone, you can see on top, the first step is to add the microphone. Then you add the processor, which is in Telemix room in this case, and then you click on optimize and it will automatically route the audio channels like this. It will just connect network mute button in Intellimix room. It will also route the speakers depending on the number of speaker what you have. So right now you see there is just one and one is still available. So I can drag over here and then I can connect the same signal to this guy or if you don't want to use it, you can just leave it. For now, I'm just going to leave it because I have to demo the audio quality. So that's fine. And uh, once that is done, you can just start your conference call. I will quickly demonstrate the configuration part of MXA 710 and then we go to the audio demo of 710. So when you see here, you can simply click on configure. You select the microphone, click on configure, and then you get this page. And right now it is showing there are three lobe, two lobes are already active, channel number one and channel three, and that's the auto mix output. The level of that is 5 dB. That's because of the, uh, the optimization what we have done here. It optimized to that level, yeah? Now, when you double click to this, you get this and you configure. Here is having the Intellimix page. Here you see AEC, noise reduction, 
if you don't optimize using designer, you can go here, you can give the reference through Dante controller, but we are simplifying your configuration by simply keeping everything by, uh, uh, ready with one click. This is the IntelliMix room. And if you have noticed that the output of IntelliMix room number one is going back to MXA 710, that's basically the AEC reference. So output, whatever is going to a speaker, is already going back to the microphone as a reference. And you, you, have, you don't need to configure that. You just click on optimize and it will route by itself. And network mute button will also be showing the con connectivity with IntelliMix room. Okay, let me double click to show you what is here. Now here is having network mute button is having the control IP address, firmware version, permission, light color. You can change the light color. So right now it's red and unmuted is green. You can change the brightness. So that's the mute button configuration. You have the logic control. So when you optimize the audio, optimize, click on optimize, it automatically um, route the, the MXA mute button and control. So I'm just gonna quickly do one thing here. I will open the configuration page. So this is the IntelliMix room. And if you see when, when MXA mute button clicked mute, it doesn't mute the input channel, it mutes to the auto mixer. And we have already discussed why. We want to maintain the AEC convergence. So mic signal is always gonna go to AEC and it will just manage with the reference. If you mute the microphone, every time you mute and unmute, AEC convergence requires, which just somehow uh, affect the AEC uh, reference. So we always recommend to mute the auto mixer after the processing to, to manage the AEC uh, reference, convergence of AEC reference. Now, quick demo on the audio side. I will just mute my microphone and turn on to other one. And I'll request my colleague to unmute the microphone. Okay, so the microphone is unmuted and you are hearing to MXA 710 linear array microphone and I am almost, uh, uh, you can say, four feet away from the microphone and it is sounding like this. And of course, when you go closer and you are having some distance, it is going to sound differently and of course, it is always going to be intelligible. Now, when you... I'm just going to show you how exactly it works. When you click on it, yeah. So when the microphone MXA mute button was pressed, the auto mixer is technically mute, getting mute, is, is muted and the audio is off. I believe you heard the MXA 710 and the voice was intelligible. So we are back to our standard setup and I'm speaking in front of Shure MV5. So that's a very simple way of demonstrating the setup right now. And of course, we are going to have a technical certification very soon. Those who guys uh, who are interested to be certified, stay in touch, and we will we will inform you about the the schedule, and you guys can certify yourself for our new ecosystem uh, solution. Yeah. So that's all from my side. Um, now, I would say let's look on the Q and A side. If we have any question, and we will answer that and we are done for this session for today.